I've seen his show many times. So when he DM'd me on Insta, I thought for sure it wasn't him. So we kind of like went back and forth a little bit. Turns out he's from Chicago. I live there. We met up a few times, like totally hit it off. This is so cool to meet somebody that you've seen on the internet and they're even more wonderful in person. I was excited. How long did you guys date for? Yeah, it was a couple months. It was right around, I would say like Thanksgiving. He comes to LA a lot too. So I would be here. We were like out in public doing things quite often. The Super Bowl happens in January and he's like, do you want to come? Well, first I was like, don't you want to bring like one of your guy friends or like your family or whatever? Mm -hmm. He's like, no, I really want to bring you. I think you'd appreciate it because I did live in Kansas City and I'm a huge Chiefs fan. I was freaking out. I was like, I'm not going to say no. Like, are you kidding me? Yeah, as far as I knew, he was comfortable with my job and comfortable with being seen with me. And yeah, it kind of wasn't the case. Then like what happened after that? He just like called you and was like, it's over or? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, wow. it was like, I can't take it. This is too much heat. The The details are between me and him, right. you know, but yeah, it was just one brief phone call and that was it. I don't want to be with somebody that doesn't want to be with me. Mm-hmm. Don't give me these fucking mixed signals. I'm also aware that what I do is not for everyone and you are totally within your rights to change your mind at any time.